Hello Aries, welcome to your October 11th through October 17th weekly love reading. Let's go ahead and get started. Remember, this isn't going to resonate with everyone, so take what does and what doesn't, just throw it out. All right, so I already pulled your cards, and let's go ahead and start right here. You have somebody, Aries, that's trying to come back. We have reconciliation, we have wedding, and we have passion. So I'm getting here that Either you're, 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 you've been separated from someone and now they're coming back and wanting to work on the marriage or someone's coming in and wanting to offer you a marriage. That's what I'm getting. There's a lot of passion that will be involved with this. They have a lot of passion for you, Aries. But I feel like right now, Aries, you're actually pretty good being alone. Because right now in your present position, this is catching my eye. You have the sun and you have the nine of cups. I feel like with these cards together for me, you're actually seeing the sunny side of life. And you're you're like, I'm good. I'm good here by myself. Like, that's what I'm getting from you. Because I see in your past position, for some of you, there were some games probably played with this person. This person was probably playing games with you, you felt. Like, they probably didn't know, you know, what they really wanted in the past. And I feel like with the Knight of Swords right here, there was a lot of possible, like, possible arguing. They were probably arguing with you, I'm seeing. Or maybe you were arguing with them. It can go vice versa. But I feel like they were kind of, like, wanting to argue with you a lot about stuff. And now you're just kind of, like, I'm kind of... I'm good. I'm happy over here. And I also feel like some of you, you just had like a hard time just balancing this relationship and stuff that you wanted to do. And the person was probably just arguing with you about it. And it kind of frustrated you. But I see this person is actually coming back. And I feel like it's a water sign. Because we've got the King of, Cup, King of Cups energy over here. I feel like they're coming back with this big offer for you. You have the Ace of Pentacles and the Fool. I feel like they're coming back either with a wink, with a ring, or some type of some type of strong offer for you. Either like, hey, like, hey, baby, let's get a house. Let's let's do this. Let's something really solid. Something big is coming in that they're going to be offering you. Because they want to start all over with you, Aries. They want to start again. But I feel like this, since this is um, also in your obstacle position, I feel like <laughs> you're kind of going to be like, okay, well, you know, prove it. Prove it to me. Because our past is kind of, you got on my nerves a little bit. The past is kind of, you know, annoying. <laughs> But I feel like this is really a good opportunity for you, Aries, when it comes to love, if you're looking for that, that love. Because we got advice from Tarot right here. We have the Ten of Cups. See the happy family right here. And the Judgment card. And for me, the Judgment card is about second chances and stuff. So I feel like this is a second chance for love and a family and happiness for you that's coming back your way. Maybe for a group of you, you felt like you missed out. Well, I feel like this week is letting you know that, no, the person's coming back. You didn't miss out. There was some separation time for a reason. We also got the King of Cups right here. Got three cards that fell out. Really emotional and burdened. I feel like this water sign is very good at kind of masking how they truly feel, but deep inside they're really emotional about it. The King of Cups is basically a, a sweetheart, very loving, very sensitive person, but they know how to control their emotions. But I feel like they're really emotional. They're feeling really emotional with this offer. I feel like they've been very burdened because you got the Ten of Wands here. I feel like 
they've been really burdened about this. And now they're trying to come back in and make amends with you. We also got opportunity right here from you. So yeah, for you, there's an opportunity right here for you. A big one that this person has to offer. Um, I also want to try something. Like think of a question. Think of a question right now, Aries. Think of it and bam, it's a yes. You got a yes. So whatever your question is, you got a yes, Aries. Forgive. It's time for you to forgive. Ego. You know, let down your guards. Sacred space. Your candle, your altar, your prayers, your candles. You know, commune with the divine. Like time to get connected with, back with the divine if you're feeling a little disconnected. Especially when it comes to a time in your life where you're trying to make a big decision. It's really important for you to get back connected with the divine. We also got right here, long distance, true love, blonde female, and family. So what I'm getting right here is this person has probably been some long distance going on. Yeah, give me a minute. They're either, they are either long distance and they're offering you true love. This person is probably, they probably left. They probably left for a while out of state, maybe overseas, but now they're sending you love. We also got blonde female. Now this could be a female that is blonde or from California or for me, like a Texas girl. It doesn't... It doesn't have to be someone who is blonde. This can also represent a female that is carefully carefree. Like you have a, you're feeling very carefree. And that makes more sense when it comes to the sun and fine with yourself. Family. We got family right here. So yeah, I feel like. You're probably a, a female. You don't have to necessarily be a female. You're feeling really carefree right now. And this is an opportunity for family again. Maybe something that you thought you weren't going to have. But it's really interesting because right now you're kind of like, I'm good. I'm perfectly good. I'm fine. But I think this situation, if you're really wanting love, a love connection and like you've just been kind of, you know, I don't, down with love. What do they call it? Down with love? I forget. That weird movie. But I'm just saying that this is an opportunity for love for you, Aries. Like a big one. Whatever this King of, King's, King of Cups type person that's coming in. They really do want to give you the world, it seems. So that's what I have for that week. Um... If you like the reading, hit the like button, hit subscribe, and hit the notification so you know when I'm uploading for future videos. And all right, love you all and many blessings to everyone.